Hi, welcome to TypeScriptic. Ever wondered what really sets apart NPM, Yarn, and PNPM? In this video, we're going to break down the strengths and weaknesses of each. Let's take a look at these package managers and see which one fits your project needs best. First up, we have NPM, the bulldog of package managers. NPM comes installed with Node.js out of the box and is one of the most widely used. It's not the fastest or the lightest, but it gets the job done and that's what makes it popular. Next up, we have Yarn. It was developed to improve NPM speed and efficiency. It's faster and more consistent with some extra functionality, like the option to use symlinks. This one's like a border collie, fast, efficient, and more consistent across environments. It is ideal if you need more speed and smooth builds across different setups. Finally, we have PNPM, the new kid on the block and the lightest of the bunch. PNPM optimizes disk usage with symlinks and a unique way of handling dependencies that reduces storage. It's like the golden poodle, new, fast, and smarter with disk usage. It is ideal for distributed and modular project setups. Now that we've met the package manager dogs, let's put them to the test in a quick race. I am testing this on an ocean cloud droplet. We'll benchmark their performance on speed and disk usage. Let's break it down. Without caching, PNPM outpaces the others, while NPM lags a bit behind. And in terms of disk space, PNPM again comes out on top making it the most efficient for larger projects. Ultimately, choosing between NPM, Yarn, and PNPM depends on your project's specific needs and your team's workflow. Each package manager has unique features and optimizations that can impact performance, disk space usage, and dependency management styles. Thanks for watching. Which package manager do you use? Bring it back here. Look at that hideous face. All right, get it out of here. As always, drop a comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech comparisons like this one. See you in the next video.